Hello friend, welcome back to Diesel Mercedes YouTube channel. I have here this W203 Mercedes Benz. I would like to go ahead and check transmission control module or TCM, which is the computer for the transmission. So I went ahead and checked my manual, which I really like. I was using that for the transmission work, but it doesn't list W203. There are different locations for different models, but not for this one. It got even more weird. I grab this manual, right? which sometimes could be pretty funny and it's also in this case listen to this i will read from the manual the transmission control module on these models is incorporated in the valve body of the transmission due to the complicated and labor intensive work required to service the module it's suggested that the procedure be done at dealership service department and you saw me removing transmission valve body in different video on this channel and I can't remember that I saw any transmission control module there. Do you remember any? So enough of the books and let's try our luck. So I will go ahead and try my luck on this side. Because I remember in many cases these computers are located behind this kick panel and let's see if I can remove it without taking apart more stuff so it's definitely the panel and I will figure out which bolts and how many I will need to remove and that plate it's held by three 10 millimeter bolts one of them is right here up there one of them is here and one of them is right here. So I will go ahead and remove those. And that should give me possibility to move this and turn it towards you. And here we go. Let's see what I discovered. And this is what you can see after you tilted that kick panel. Right. Most importantly, this is the TCM. As said, it has uh, two connectors, right? It's very, very small in size. It has two connectors and you can read with me the number. It's A032-545-3232. Made by Siemens. And somebody new to this channel might say, well, why you are crawling through here and looking at the transmission control module? Like, what's your problem, dude? But we already know that if you have some transmission problems, some shifting or something, you definitely want to check this. Mainly, you want to check the connectors if actually the transmission fluid didn't crawl and entered this entire computer through those wires. We know there is such a possibility that transmission fluid was leaking so badly that it made all the way to this computer. Or another example, if you don't want to drop the whole transmission and remove the valve body, you can actually read from these wires if you know which ones to touch. You can, for example, read the resistance of the shift solenoids. So this is definitely a great place for some advanced diagnosis. And for me, that was all I needed to know to confirm that there's no presence of the automatic transmission fluid and the computer is in the good shape and in the dry place. So thanks for watching and make sure you are subscribed because I have way more videos about Mercedes coming away. See ya!